Hello viewers, welcome to a program that provides you insights on people, luxury and beyond. A place where we take you to the world of a first class lifestyle. For the next 30 minutes, I'm your host Ines Putri and this is High End on TV. For your information, this program is a part of our sister group, The High End Magazine. So don't go anywhere while we take you to a world of high end in Indonesia. Viewers, High End on TV visited Bali to attend an event held by Mensa Indonesia. There, we also saw a fashion show by Aryani Praja Saputra. Let's take a look. Hai and viewers, beberapa waktu lalu diadakan sebuah event gathering yang diadakan oleh sebuah organisasi perkumpulan para jenius ber-IQ tinggi, Mensa Indonesia. Mengambil lokasi di Nusa Dua Bali, event Asian Mensa Gathering 2012 ini dihadiri oleh para Mensa Group dari beberapa negara antara lain Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapura, Korea, Jepang, Pakistan, China, Hong Kong, Filipina, Australia, New Zealand, dan lain-lain. Gathering dari uh, anggota Mensa dari seluruh dunia ke Asia. Jadi bukan hanya member Mensa Asia, tapi Mensa seluruh dunia. Mensa itu adalah orang-orang yang mempunyai IQ 2% teratas dari populasi. Atau kalau kita melihat skala, kira-kira di atas 140 IQ-nya. There is no doubt that human quality is the prime factor for national wealth. The different factor is whether the majority of the people in a particular nation earn more than they consume in their entire life or the other way around. During the three-day event, the participants had a conference discussing a topic called Global Brains for the Poor. The main goals are basically to discuss various aspects to improve people's brain power, to declare a comprehensive roadmap to increase community economic level by brain power enhancement, and to define the role of Mensa International in these efforts. Kita di sini itu mengundang mereka satu untuk memperkenalkan Indonesia kepada seluruh dunia. Ya, supaya lebih banyak lagi orang-orang dari seluruh dunia datang ke Indonesia, ke Bali ya. Dan juga ada special mission yaitu kita juga ingin mengundang mereka untuk sama-sama membahas satu peta Bagaimana kita bisa membantu orang miskin menolong dirinya mereka dengan memberdayakan kemampuan otak mereka um, I'm very glad about it because um a few years ago it started in Europe when we first started with the EMAC and uh, which is like a, a regional mentor inviting the neighbors and organizing with everyone together and showing their specialties like regional and arts as well and then it came over to Asia and now it's the second one in Asia which is like last year Malaysia this year it's over here in Bali so it's really really good thing I think it brings everybody closer together I've heard somebody say what you're doing is a work for peace because everybody becomes brothers they come together they learn from each other so I think it's a really really good event The participants also had the chance to enjoy various cultural entertainment such as Bali traditional dance and musical performances. One of the most exciting entertainments was a fashion show by Aryani Praja Saputra, one of the most prominent Indonesian accessory designers. Hanya satu designer Aryani, uh, karena Aryani juga member dari Mensa dan dia juga sangat uh, apa, kreatif. Ya. Jadi mungkin yang menarik buat member yang lain juga Bagaimana bisa sekreatif dia gitu ya di samping juga menikmati hasil karyanya yang uh, desain yang yang baik tersebut gitu ya. Sebentar lagi kita akan ajak mereka untuk belajar Balinese dance dan juga kecak dance supaya mereka bukan hanya melihat tapi juga terlibat di dalamnya sehingga mereka biasanya kalau terlibat ke dalamnya mereka merasa lebih seru dan lebih enjoy gitu. I'm sure it's very I'm sure it's very very interesting. I have not seen enough to really give you a full 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 statement but uh, the part that I've seen about the batik and so it's really nice.
Ariani showcased a highlight of traditional attires brought from her cultural journeys with LC Foundation to Western Kutai, East Borneo, Flores, and Tete, and Wamene, Papua. In collaboration with some of the chosen members of Mensa as the models, Ariani brought a selection of her ethnic contemporary catwalk collection inspired by the culture of Mina, Bali, ethnic Java, and Batak. Jadi busana-busana tradisional memang kita bawa dari daerah-daerah masing-masing. Dari uh, dari Kutai, dari Wamena, dan dari uh, Ende. Lalu setelah itu saya gabungkan dengan vers versi kuturnya. Jadi catwalk version dari uh, koleksi saya yang sudah pernah ditampilkan sebelumnya di ajang Indonesia Fashion Week dan beberapa koleksi tambahan yang baru. Jadi untuk koleksi saya itu saya mengambil inspirasi dari beberapa daerah, Minang, uh, Bali, Uh, Batak dan uh, Jawa dan dari tapi itu sudah saya interpretasikan menjadi sesuatu yang bersifat high end. Oh, it was amazing. Uh, I it was for an Indonesian traditional thing mm, and it was performed by an amateur, not a professional, but it was very funny and. Uh, I think it was very uh, religious and uh, it's re good reflect of uh, an Indonesian history. Okay. Uh, I thought the fashion show was very interesting and I like that it gave me an insight into Indonesian culture and I also really like uh, seeing the cultural traditional clothing Um, adjusted for more modern setting, so I thought the fashion looked very nice and very wearable. Saya harap uh, nama Indonesia budaya kita itu makin bergaung di dunia fashion di luar melalui uh, orang-orang ini dan mungkin melalui teman-teman mereka lagi jika mereka nanti melihat uh, liputan mereka dari acara ini. After the break, we are going to present you a profile of a New York-based Indonesian designer, Ardistia. Don't go anywhere, stay tuned right where you are, high on TV, we'll be back soon.